Hey guys, <laughs> welcome back to Frenemies. I'm Ian, and guys, we are we are back with Agents of Shield. <laughs> uh, oh, I'm so happy! Like holy crap! I've been waiting since the end of season five, as well as everybody else. And I apologize. What I left y'all with last was with the bad camera quality stuff. <laughs> as I started that. I started Shield. You know, well, I, I did. I did those when I just started reacting. So I was pretty trash at it. Camera was bad. My editing wasn't great. Um, well, the editing was good in in the in the Shield stuff. But like, if you went back to like the, my old stuff, that like old uploaded stuff, yeah, it's not great. But anyway, <laughs> oh my god. This is, this is gonna be the first good sh quality shield video or reaction on my on my channel anyway um, apart from the season six trailer reaction I haven't watched anything apart from that trailer by the way so I have no idea what's going on um, no tidbits I've I try to stay away from any anything on on Twitter on Instagram the only thing I've seen is maybe a poster but I think it was like fan made um, God dang, I can't even, I'm just like almost shaking right now just how excited I am to finally be back. Um, super curious what's going on with the whole Coulson thing. I know it's not our original Coulson. It's, uh, the only thing I know is that, it, well, it, I mean, it's obviously a doppelganger. It's obviously not, it's obviously not Coulson. I don't know if it's like, uh, something, a time aberration kind of thing or another dimension, like another Earth sort of thing. I don't know. But I do remember last season... We left off, and luckily, the only good side, good thing to having held back on editing last season's Shield stuff is that I got to rewatch all those episodes recently. Um, so I got a bit of a refresher. I'm not gonna go into the whole thing. I'm just you know, basically the last episode. You know, we lost Fitz, but like the future Fitz. Um, but we're still getting like we're getting the present Fitz back. So I don't know how long it's gonna take to find him though. There's only 13 episodes this season, so. It shouldn't take that long, or maybe we don't. Well, no, I think we were gonna find him this season. Um, but I'm just 13 episodes. Dude, that means it's gonna be pretty tight, like a pretty tight story. Um, not a whole lot of room for like. Not they didn't really have a whole lot of filler in Shield, like uh, uh, since season two or three, three maybe. I think um, there was always something going on. So. Uh, um, yeah, it's Max Director. Phil's dead, sadly. Um, well, our our original Phil May's probably gonna, uh, May's coming back. I know that. I know that from the from the trailer. Daisy's got a new do. Um, yeah, that's all. That's all I'm gonna say. We're gonna go ahead and get started now. Oh, dude, this is, I'm loving this recap. It's so cool looking. Ugh. Even when I knew what was going on, that scene killed me, man. They're not nearly as bad as my stupid self in the actual reaction video, but I was tearing up. Dude, we're back. <laughs> Alright, director. Where to first? Crap, I'm tearing up right now. Jesus Christ, what's wrong with me? Like, did we already find him? An extremely difficult computation, considering the circumstance. We're just getting back and already we're jumping into crap. But Enoch, Jesus, I didn't even, can, I just realized, Christ. <laughs> what is this? Oh. What the heck just happened? One year later? Jesus, we are going all out in space already. Not my best. Not your best, Davis. Thanks, sidekick. <laughs> Where's the rest of them? They ha Oh, there she is. I'm unarmed. Ooh. 
but you are gorgeous. Who is this girl? We get a name? Daisy Johnson or Quake, if you would. Quake. For her. Okay. That's new. I think. <laughs> Didn't miss a beat. Give us what we want and we'll let you live to cry about it. You want fuel, it's yours. There it is. We're, we're. Dialing in. What is going on? Somewhere Are these the people that uh, were in the trailer? Do you hear that? I mean, they feel it, probably. Come again? Yeah, not... Um, look. I don't think I understand how a reality is supposed to work, but that ain't part of it. Um... It's so weird. But it is so well done. Like, what the heck? Uh oh, he did. Surrender now, or we will fire. Well, I said we will fire. I didn't tell you to fire. Oh, God. Well, still watching those? I'm hesitant to stop. He'd be proud. The job suits you. The agents out there know it. Yeah, well, I'll never be the director Coulson was. No, you're a different director. It's not a bad thing. While that makes it easier to lift ore out of the ground, it makes your cells gelatinous, your bones porous. Now, I'm no expert in Derillian anatomy. When I cut into your corpse, I will be, but I assume enough time under this pressure and either your brain will hemorrhage or the weight of your organs will collapse your lungs. So will we find him? Please tell me what we find him this episode. I know it's the first, but I want him back. We've been, we've gone through long enough. You don't tell me it was opened. Bloody freaking prince. As for myself, I'm not afraid of Matt finding out. While I am, he is not small. <laughs> Honestly, I have too much respect for the guy. I'd much rather we tell him about it than have him stumble on it. Alright, fine, I like him. With. This lady said more to me in one phone call than she did in all the years that she was married to Garner. <laughs> uh, no details, of course, and, uh, well, I didn't need him. Shield Academy. Not overnight. We wouldn't open it for a year or two, but we need you to build it from the ground up in his name. Shield Second Chance. Two of our brightest minds are in deep space. They can't make contact and until they jump back. We need you on this or innocent people will die. Did you say deep space? Did we get him? I mean, one more week with Davis and you will find a dead body, his. Yes, because one more week with you and I will definitely kill myself. <laughs> you guys never wavered. You stayed on when the rest of the crew got off. Thank you. We need them. And they may need us. Dang it. Open your eyes. There's gotta be something there. Please. Translated, it means low temperature suspension chamber. You learned to read alien? Of course. What have you been doing with the last year? Underneath that phrase was a word. Narrow Atsia, I've seen it before. It's a planet. Here. Well, don't talk tactics, he's family. Yeah, other people have family too. We gave us as a kid, remember? I haven't seen him in months. Daisy, please, come on. Hey, no, 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 you don't do that. You don't make that decision without us. I'm the one who flies this thing. Look, we are in this with you. 
We are all just worn very thin. This on his neck? Tell me that's not a lens of some sort. I got you. I got you. You can't stop it. It's coming. Because if I win, we'll be dead and you won't have to pay me. Look at you finally catching on. Guys. Start later. Davis wins. Yep. Oh, Jesus. Well, that's a lot more than I thought they were shooting at. Oh, Davis, please move like you never moved before. Thank God, I thought it just ended. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Hurry! Enter the coordinates for Earth. Let's get out of here. The coordinates are already locked in. Simmons. I'm sorry. Hi, Simmons. With pleasure. Excuse me, why? Do you have to bleed to use your powers? Do you, does your powers include your blood? Do you... Uh, shut up, Ian. Stay back! Hold your fire! Oh. Or that. Don't worry. You'll be a butterfly. Oh, no. Not what I thought that was in the trailer. Jesus. Why is it colorful all of a sudden? Oh. Excuse? What? Is this gonna be Coulson? That's Coulson. Holy crap. I don't ask twice. Don't kill him. You're... You're from S.H.I.E.L.D. Never heard of it. Oh my god, he's so cool! But he's terrible! Oh man, what an entrance! And it's gonna end. Yep. We'll return in a moment. What's the moment? Is that Fitz? Please be Fitz. Well, they're back. <laughs> I, God, that was just so much happening, so much change. Some I don't like the fact that Yo-Yo and Mac aren't a thing anymore. It's kind of sad considering what we were, how the how the relationship was in four and in five, um, for the most part, up until things got a little hairy. I was hoping, I thought that they would, that that would be fixed by. The, I thought it was fixed by the end of the season, but. I guess I didn't realize they didn't exactly address it. I mean, they they weren't close, really, like nearing the end. There was it was very it was a little more distant between them. So I guess it, they didn't get through it. Max either pushing her away because of what the troubles they were having between them, or because he is going to his work. I don't know. I'm, I mean, I'm assuming it's the former, but but what an entrance by Coulson! Holy crap! I didn't know how he was going to come in like that. Like, again, the only thing I've seen was uh, the trailer that's on the, that I reacted to on the channel. I didn't, re I didn't watch the other the other trailer that, re that came out, like, last week, I think it was. Like, last week or two weeks ago. So I don't know if any of that was in this 
in that in the trailer. Uh, if it is, you guys really shouldn't watch it, <laughs> just because you you get so much more if you whack, just watch it in the episode. But man, whew, what a freaking entrance! That was the. I mean, Coulson's always been cool, sometimes in dorky ways, but he's just so different. I mean, we've only seen a little bit of him, like a few moments, but it's just like very huge contrast. Like one, he killed this guy, just. He just had the, I guess, restrain the girl. I don't know. He didn't quite cuff her, but you know, he he asked. He, he even said, "I don't ask twice." And he just straight up quick draw and shot the guy. Very fast draw, by the way. God dang, man, that dude. We just barely met him, and I felt bad. He's like he's like a kid. He's dead, right? I mean, that looked like that was blood or something, or maybe it was something else. But that dude's dead, and that sucks. I was kind of worried about the you other's know, new boyfriend. I think they're taking. Are they like dating, dating, or they're just? I don't know if they're trying to wait till they tell Mac or I don't know, but I didn't like him mainly because of that and also because he was new and he was making jokes and not the not the fact that he was making jokes made me dislike him. It was just uh, I felt like he was hitting on someone. I don't know why I thought May just because I guess I maybe I looked down and I missed the look on Yo-Yo or I just forgot the look on Yo-Yo, but I saw a look of that May gave and I was like, is something going on there or is he trying to is he trying to go do something? But and it's been a year, so I mean things you can move on after a year. I mean some some mean some need more time after a loved one's death. So I mean I don't know. Um, I mean I don't think I would. I don't think May would either. But I'm just it's possible. Um, but you know it was something going on with them, so that kind of made me dislike him. But he seems like a good guy. You know he respects Mac, which <sighs> wins points. <laughs> Sucks. Man, why you why you gotta be a good guy? Why can't you be like trash and then I can just I can hate you with validation, you know? I can I can feel validated in my hatred for you, but I don't I can't hate him. Seems like a good guy. Seems to care about her and he's giving her the space she needs. Um so I don't know. <sighs> Dang it. I don't know. I mean, as long as she's happy and as long as he can work his way to getting happy. He's not happy because of her, but I guess he's just dealing with things still but I hope both of them can work through what they're dealing with um, if this guy makes her happy then I guess I guess I can be okay with it but all right, I'll get into other stuff but I just you know the thing with Fitz just hit me so hard like what the heck is going on there first off he learned he learned uh, alien too just like his wife well they're, they don't know he doesn't know they're married but you know they belong together. <laughs> they literally, they both learned alien. Um, that <laughs> such a freaking. I love Simon when she said, uh, whenever Piper asked her about, uh, when she asked her that she, if she learned alien, and, and Simon just returns with, oh, yeah, what did you do this year, or what were you doing in the year, or something like that. Just well, s excuse me, I'm sorry. What was I thinking? You're right, Gemma. Gemma learned a completely different language. I mean. It's different, a completely different, like, alien, different species language. <laughs> it's crazy, but so did Fitz. So that happened a year ago, so he's been, so I'm wondering, is that, like, whatever, like, whatever happened to him, like, did they capture and then, like, alter his mind, or is he actually there, and, like, what's the injection? Is the injection, like, I, I saw his eyes, obviously, you know, they literally had his eyes closed and then opened them to show the, the, whatever he took, did that to his eyes. Um, or maybe it wasn't. Maybe they're like that now. Bef like it was before the injection. Like whatever. Maybe they did something to him to where his eyes are different. Like they mess with his genetic makeup or something. I don't know. Uh, but I was just wondering, like wondering if like his mo if he's if he doesn't know he's fits. Like if he's somebody else right now. Like if they again like if they altered his mind. I don't know. And that would suck. Cause I mean, come on. They why do you gotta keep separating them? Why do you have to keep separating? I just freaking sorry. <laughs> it just hit me. Like, they they always separate Fitz and Simmons. Like, why? Can't you just leave them alone? Let them be together. Maybe not in peace, but let them at least be together in the same place. There's never been a season after season one where they just, they, where they can at least, where they can be together. Where they're, where they're not split apart for some reason or another. Season two... Gemma left to be undercover at Hydra. Season 3, she was sucked into the monolith. I mean, it was for a day, but still. 
for for them it was six months, right? Six months. Season four. Fitz was put in the in the framework and then became Leopold. And there was a little, little bit of a fissure between them after that, but not for long. And then she, they freaking sent to the future. Fitz went into the future for it. Like he froze himself to get the team and Gemma, of course. That was probably at the forefront of his mind. But And, and then freaking. We had the hope. We had the hope at the end of last season. Like, okay, guys, we'll just we'll go get uh, Simmons and un uh, Simmons, sorry Fitz. We'll get him, unfreeze him. Everything will be great. Nah, mm -mm, no. The very beginning, we're just gonna have some laser whip vortex thing just show up out of nowhere and just slice that ship in half, grab Fitz, and then leave the freaking uh, cryopod or whatever cryostasis pod or whatever. Leave it empty there for Fitz to, for Simmons to have hope, and then open it, and then there's nothing. So he he went there to be frozen. Then wait, so maybe he was, because I know Simmons said that he he read that, went to the thing, and get frozen to get frozen again. But like, how? Like, how do you? Was the okay, so the ship was taken there, uh, or left there? I was so excited for a second. I thought we we're gonna have Enoch again. Are we not gonna have Enoch? Is he not gone still? Like, we had him for one scene. Like, seriously, guys, you're going to get him for one scene? I mean, we have that one guy, the shield guy that, that I don't know if his name is what I'm going to call him now. For, for now, I'm going to call him Coulson. Shot the one dude, the, the new one of the new guys, and killed him. He was in here for an episode. So, I mean, I can't say that they wouldn't do that. <laughs> They've done that before, too, before that. But, come on! God, I'm just so happy it's back, but I'm just so frustrated <laughs> with what we got, and it's just... Mm, we have to get him back next episode. There's 13 episodes this season. There's, no, there's not a whole lot of wiggle room for just... To, I don't want it to be like at the end of the season. We have to get him before that. Come on. Don't keep them apart again. Jesus. If they, I swear to God. If they keep them apart, if they separate them next season, like... I'm gonna... I'm gonna lose it. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done with the show. No, I'm not. I can never be done with the show. God dang it. I hate them for that. <laughs> what have they done to me? That's <laughs> so infuriating. <laughs> oh, man. I don't... I've hardly looked at my notes, but I'm pretty sure I've tackled a good piece... I've tackled some bits in here just because keep... it's flashing in my mind. Just everything that's going, that's happened this, this season. Let's see. The alien, he did that. Oh, I wanted to say... Um, that injection thing, I'm wondering, like, because I don't know what the controller. Wait a minute. Mm -hmm. The controller. Isn't that. Like, I don't remember. It's been a minute. Hold on. Let me just double check. But, like, isn't. Well, before I say anything, I'm not, uh, I don't want to look like a fool. So I'm going to look it up first. Oh, dang it. Controller. Dang it. Grandmaster controller. Isn't the controller something in, like, a Game Master kind of guy, kind of like Grandmaster? I thought he was. I don't... It sounds familiar. So is it... I'm wondering, is Fitz going... doing basically a, a gladiatorial thing, and that's like... the injection is like a, a strength enhancement or something? He was doing something within the... like, he was, he was sharpening something. Did he make a weapon, or was he... I don't know. I have no idea, because it was dark. For good reason, you know they they were concealing fits for one. I'm not 100 sure what I, I thought for a second that he was trying to power whatever was on the table, trying to make some some uh, some kind of energy to maybe I don't know. Uh, and then I was I thought he was sharpening something. I don't I don't quite know. I have to I'll probably look. I'll probably see it and edit and the during editing and then just be mad at myself for not realizing what it was, which happens a lot. <laughs> And this chick with the your your what's it you'll be a butterfly? What is that about? Like, does anybody know about that? If you do, don't tell me. I'm just thinking out loud. Like, what the heck? And I thought I I didn't know what I I got thrown so many loops. Like in the trailer, what is it they're doing? Who are these people? And why are they here? Are they reality warper benders? The one guy was kind of that's sad. He seemed like a fun guy. He seemed like a good good kid. I dared to call him our, uh, their Cisco just because he was trying to name these people, and he was very much 
wanting to have to, uh, wanting them to have a name, <laughs> which is very Cisco for those that don't know. I'm talking about it's the Flash, the CW. Um, but yeah. <sighs> Uh, what a way to come into the season, man. So much going on. So much... Ugh, I, I hated seeing Simmons, like Dark Simmons, essentially, like a darker Simmons. I I, I mean, I hated it, but it was also kind of cool. Like, I love Elizabeth so much. She's such a great actor. She's so gorgeous. She, and she's just... she's got, She's got, like, a uh, an elegant beauty to her. Um, as goofy as she is. But like Daisy's gorgeous, or sorry, um, crap, Chloe's gorgeous. But like Elizabeth's, uh, they're they're very gorgeous. They're both gorgeous in a very different way, in very different ways. I can't even speak. <laughs> that their, their gorgeousness is just buffering me. My brain is it can't handle it. The two different gorgeouses are. I'm gonna shut up now. <laughs> seeing uh Simmons like that, seeing Gemmins like that, it was just. That she was essentially torturing the guy, or she was more so telling him how he would be tortured by being hung up that way, and she and after he was dead, how she would uh, cut open his corpse and you know basically study it. <sighs> Jesus, <laughs> like I said this, I, I said this, I, little, I said this in the in the during the reaction. I don't know if I kept it, but I probably did. But she's basically like becoming Leopold Gemma, which is fitting. I mean, they were kind of both sort of going that route last season, sort of. Like, after the whole thing with uh, Daisy, like, when he gave her her powers back, um, obviously he wasn't treated right, <laughs> or he was looked down on for understandable reasons. Um, but Simmons kind of understood where he was coming from, and then she kind of sort of went in the same pathway sort of he he didn't go as bad as leopold he left that he was more so he just kind of did things what he felt needed to be done afterwards um and he was doing that before too like the whole thing with the the wire when they were escaping like the the trap that severed those uh crease heads um but yeah it, i think that's just i don't think that's i don't think that's just the whole like looking for fits thing and being stressed and and being pulled so thin and with worry, not being able to find fits and the grief that she's trying to fight down. It's also just kind of how how they were going last season. Did the budget get bigger? I feel like the budget's big. It's either, it's either they just got a bigger budget, or they have more. They have the same amount of budget, but they can just do more with the shorter season, or both. It could be both, but because it was a lot going on <laughs> this season, like a bunch bigger. Much bigger setting, um, for one, because we were we had we, last season we were re reusing the the same set a lot of the times. Like the in the future, we had the the lighthouse where that was in the space. And then we went back to the present. They were still in the, they were in, they used the same building because you know one it it was actually the same building, um. So they they were they stayed in that a lot. They went outside not as they didn't go outside as often, and they used the hallways the same hallways a lot like uh, when they were doing the Hydra Academy that was a lot a lot of times that was the same these are setting a lot of times but this one they they were in the bunker a little bit I don't know was it a bunker <laughs> anyway they're, they're at the base and uh, but they also have like the ship and the different planet I mean granted they didn't show them too much but still like the fact what they were showing is like that scale is still impressive especially on a on a TV show like this also I wasn't expecting a time jump I, sh I I don't know if I should have. <laughs> should I have I expected a time jump? I mean, it's one year later. I mean, to be fair, it was. I guess it's maybe going with how long we waited for the season to come back because it's been a year since the season went out. I guess that's what they're like. That might be what they were doing. They were matching the time. I don't know. It's crazy thinking just how like seeing just the the amount of changes, like seeing the new people. And they're recruiting apparently, they're, and uh, they're recruiting that. Now they've recruited this one guy. What's his name? Doctor Michael Benson, 150 IQ. Okay, <laughs> um, he's gonna be the, the head department. And are they are, are they reopening uh, Shield Academy? That's what it seems like they're doing. Pretty sure I heard that right. They're basically putting it back together, and he's gonna get the smartest minds and basically do what uh, what the, the academy that fits in Simmons, the part of the academy that fits in Simmons went to. 
Um, because I know they have separate uh, schools for that, right? Like, I'm pretty sure because that was set in season one, but it's been a while uh, since I've seen that. I should probably, I, I kind of want to rewatch season one. Uh, well, just the whole series to be honest. And he's a friend of Andrew's, and it's kind of it's kind of cool they mentioned him again. It's been well, no, we mentioned him last season. I don't. It's just cool uh, hearing the uh, having that connection with uh, with May. Like she knew who he was. Um, it's kind of funny how he mentioned that. You know, this is the most she said to me since uh, those two were married. Like she hasn't spoken to me. Uh, she didn't speak to me that much. But it's gonna be interesting. He's gonna be. Is he gonna be at the base? Because I wonder. Again, I was. They said reopening Sheila Cabin, but he was at the base. Maybe that was just for that, like to, to look at the the one guy that was stuck in the brick wall. Speaking of which, he was alive for a little bit. What is going on? <laughs> Seriously, what is going on with these people? Like, what are they? Like, the basketball shattered. Like, does whenever they're crossing, apparently, this what well, that's what they said. When they're crossing, does like is it just affect the whole area? And Gwaze, whoa, and Daisy, I said Gwaze, I think I was trying to say Quake and Daisy, but some reason it went guh. Anyway, Daisy, she quaked those guns, like, in a very different way. <laughs> she, I mean, I'm pretty sure she can still the but it just, like, I don't, I mean, I don't think they, they changed the design of her powers, like, how they look, but that was, that was cool, just the way it, she went like that, and it was kind of just tearing them apart, like, not blasting them, like, literally just, they were still float, they were floating in the air, and they, fell apart kind of so that was that was a cool use like use of the power i don't think i've seen her do that before i don't think and i kind of like um another jump sorry i kind of like um and it's also kind of sad to, to to see um is regular colson even though he's only a hologram and max having uh more he's had morning what is it morning check-ins he he rewatches those and it kind of it's kind of sad like i mean i understand i would it's hard to it's hard to let go of that to, of let it go of Coulson, and he even said he's he's hesitant to, hesitant to stop. I kind of wish we got a we got to see like Coulson and May like a, at least a, a a day or something of of them together. Just kind of, I mean I don't know what they could show. <laughs> like there wouldn't I guess there's not much that they could really be doing like uh, just kind of lounging about and stuff. But like, and I'm not saying like the whole episode, but just kind of like showing them having. Like enjoying the time he has left with they, the time they have left with each other, it would just it would just be nice to see Coulson again, you know, like regular good Coulson. Um, I don't, I mean, we don't know what these people do, what they're doing, like what they're what they're here for. Maybe they're not the bad guys. I don't know. Um, but it it right now it kind of, it kind of. I don't know. I'm I'm for now I'm reluctant to say it, but I will say it anyway. They're not. They kind of seem like the bad guys. But I've been proven wrong before, countless times. Um, so I don't know. A lot of people are pairing up. Like, there's the I, what's the guy's name? I didn't even I, I couldn't quite catch it. And I don't remember really. It was like Kel, the guy that Yo -Yo's, uh, Yo Yo's with. Is it Keller or Geller? Am I wrong on both accounts? Like, which one is it? And then there's Piper and Daisy. They're obviously flirting a lot. <laughs> um, just in the more schoolyard kind of kind of way. No, they make a cute couple. Is he is he with somebody or are they trying are are they pairing them together because they said he had a son doesn't that mean he has a wife or a girlfriend I'm just wondering if he does and if it is are they, is that just them being friends are they just like best friends I don't know um but I felt I hated the like the the team friction um like with Simmons and against basically the rest of them Daisy Piper and Davis. I mean, they, yeah, they, they both have, like, I want, I want to, I would go with Gemma, I'm on Gemma's side, I want to go, you know, go to where she thinks Fitz is, that's just me, that's me being biased, that's me just wanting Fitz, I want them to hurry up and get Fitz, but, I mean, the, the whole thing, with they have families back at home too, they have, you know, Davis has his son that he hasn't seen in months, which is terrible, um, I don't know about Piper or Daisy's the only her family is the rest of Shield, so I mean tech, she is with some of her family, but you know they there's the rest of them the majority of them are still at home. I think let me just double check, but I think that's all that I put down, guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's everything I have down. 
lot to discuss this episode. Man, that was a lot. Uh, this is gonna be a long edit. <laughs> um, it's gonna be hard to edit. This is always Sheila's always hard to edit. Super hard to edit. Like god dang, so much I wanted to keep in uh, the last season stuff. But what can you do? Great start to the season. I enjoyed it a lot. Um, I'm excited. To see, I'm excited for the season, man. I'm. I'm just. I'm worried for a guy. Shield just always have you it's excited, worried, stressed. It's that's what Shield is. That's what Shield has. That's what it has become. I hope they fight. I really, really hope they find fit soon. Like most of the time, people would probably not disagree because you know that they feel like it's too fast. And in a ser season where that's like 22, 23 episodes, they would probably be right. But I still would want it to be sooner rather than later. But seeing as we have only 13 episodes, I feel like it should be sooner. Like, that would be practical. Instead of stretching it out, um, like prolonging his them finding him. But I, I, hope it's, I hope it's next episode, third the latest. That's just me. I, I, just, I just want Fitz back. I want Fitz and Simmons to be back together again. God, this is... They always split up those two, and I'm not having it. Well, guys, that's it. We are back with Agents of Steel. This is season six. Whew, I am not ready, but I'm ready. Um, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Because I know I definitely did. <laughs> I'm not sure if you could tell. Uh, if you want to check out the rest of my stuff, go and click the bubble right next to me. And if you want to stick around for next week's episode, go and click the subscribe button. If you want to be notified whenever our videos go down, go up. Go to the bell icon down below. Um, again, guys, that's it. Thanks for watching, and hope to see you next week.